Uh, she lives in Nashville, recently sold out shows in Chicago and Indianapolis, and tomorrow, one of the Coastal Empire's most popular performers is coming home. Hey, I'm Hannah Dasher, and I'm coming back to the Savannah Theater this weekend, September 23rd. Woo! It's a honky-tonk rock and roll show, so come for a good time. I might set my wig on fire. Ryan Spencer opening the show, 8 p.m. See you there. Well, it is always exciting to have a local star come back yes. to a place where so many of Savannah's biggest names have performed. Mike Zoller is the co-owner of the Savannah Theater Company. He's here this morning with a look ahead to uh, Hannah Dasher show, but also a very busy fall season yes. at the Savannah Theater. Good morning. How are you doing? Good morning, Tim. Thanks for having us on. What a great Isn't atmosphere. Isn't this fantastic? I yeah, we this. are really proud of this and we are loving it so far. And I'm sure you got to love having Hannah Dasher come to town. Yeah, we first met Hannah Dasher about 10 years ago. We were doing a Patsy Cline show, oh, wow. and um, we were going to bring somebody in from Branson, Missouri. And people, we said, well, we'll audition some people locally. And somebody said, oh, there's this girl from Springfield. And she came and auditioned. We said, call the girl from Branson. <laughs> she, she doesn't have to come. Yeah. And uh, so Hannah came out, and boy, she, she did that. And then wow. uh, uh, she did our Country Star Review show and did some of the great classic uh, country artists in that one and uh, it wasn't too long after that that she she took off to Nashville yeah. and started writing songs and playing in bars and doing whatever she could and and uh, here she is now she's, yeah. she's, yeah, touring, she's blown up headlining she? her own tour 1.5 million followers wow. on TikTok. I mean you're a social media guy you oh, know yeah. how many yeah, that that's, that's, a that's a lot yeah uh, and she's uh, she's got a little mini cooking show stand by your pan <laughs> that's really taken off I think she was a guest on like Rachel Ray and all oh, these cooking man. shows just because she's got into that she's and she's a character I mean, oh yeah, you can yeah. See she, just from that clip she plays up that persona i mean you know saying she's gonna light her wig on fire well, she's not you know? playing it up that's <laughs> hannah that's Let hannah, me tell you. Right. she's great and that's what comes across on stage and that's what people are going to see tomorrow night it's going to be a lot of energy a lot of great music uh just a, a special show absolutely and she um she's what you need to be in these days she's her own songwriter Oh, wow. She, so she performs her own music. She, she dropped a record called The Half Record uh, a couple years ago. And then this summer, she dropped one called The Other Half. <laughs> so she's going to be playing songs for, that, that she wrote you know, and co-wrote. And uh, she's just got a great energy. So it's a great time to, for Savannians to come out and support yeah. one of their own and just have a good time. Yeah, and, you know, f folks here are so proud of her, to having yes. gone to Nashville. You know, it's not easy to break in in Nashville. It is not easy. It. Even when you're really talented, it's right. hard to get in the, in the door. So she, uh, she went the right path, I think. Yeah. Started as a songwriter. She's written stuff for other people, and that yeah. kind of keeps getting you through yeah. the door. So now we've got the chance to see you here tomorrow night. Uh, tickets still available? Tickets are still available, and uh, we want to we want to pack the house out for it, you know, and show her some some Savannah love Excellent. for sure. Where can folks get those tickets? Uh, SavannahTheater.com, or they can call the box office uh, two three three seven right. seven six four. And I tell you, there's almost always somebody there because you are so busy at Savannah Theater. You've got a busy fall and into, right into the winter coming up. Right, we're running Savannah Live right now, uh, which is always a whole lot of fun review show, and we are rehearsing right now. We finally got the rights. It's been on my bucket list to play Tevia and Fiddler on the roof which so explains the the beard explains <laughs> the facial hair that i'm growing uh, well, i'm about four weeks in so i got six more weeks of growing the beard before oh, wow. the show opens we're going to run that in november november 3rd through the 19th three weekends super nice. excited about that show and that's going to lead right into really so many people's favorite of the year yes thanksgiving night we open the christmas wow. show it'll run through christmas eve and it, it truly is my favorite show we do uh if people yeah. say what's the best show what's that you can come to the christmas show it's the best one and that's one that you have a lot of local actors and and singers performing we in? do we get to have a little bit bigger cast in that show because yeah. uh, there's a lot of reindeer and Santa's in there and some elves running around so uh, we get to include some children uh, oh, wow. ours are getting a little older than we would prefer <laughs> to be the little kids in the show so there may be some auditions coming up so yeah we try to include the community Fantastic. on that one. Yeah, it's it's been 20 years for you now over Savannah 21 years. 21 years can you believe that unbelievable uh, we officially can go have a drink at McDonald's there you go the street. <laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> right well i know you were going to enjoy uh, the whole fall the whole winter but tomorrow night is going to be a great night with Hannah Dasher there a great party and, you uh, bet looking forward to that mike so, thanks so much for coming thanks by. tim appreciate it well, coming up after the break, we will introduce you to this week's Rescue Me Friday Pop.